What's up everyone, it's Tom here. In this video, we're gonna be beginning a brand new series, a series called Explained in Three Minutes or Less. I do regular in-depth interviews with founders of projects to discuss how their projects can disrupt traditional industries. But I also wanna give a brief overview, almost like a little teaser before we release the interview. So without any further ado, let's jump into the first one. This is gonna be interviewing one of the founders of Rent Protocol, interoperability solution in the decentralized finance sector. Let's jump in. Basically, you have all of these blockchains uh, that are in their little isolated blockchain worlds, and they have no way to communicate with each other. Uh, um, there's a lot of efforts to get that to happen, but you have to, as a chain, decide that you want to participate in that interoperability protocol in order to gain the benefits. What RenVM allows you to do is uh, unchain uh, all of that liquidity and let them interoperate without asking to do any work. Our network does all of the work and it brings the interoperability to the table instead of the other way around. And it does that without any trust, without any middleman or, or centralized party whatsoever. You could imagine a DEX on Ethereum that is able to trade Bitcoin pairs, or you could imagine that uh, a MakerDAO CDP could be collateralized by Bitcoin and not some wrapped ERC-20 representation of Bitcoin, the actual real Bitcoin that you send using the Bitcoin network. So the token is used to bond to the network and it gives you the right to run what's called a dark node. Uh, and as part of running a dark node, you're able to earn a share of the liquidity that moves through the platform. Uh, and that sort of feeds back into the network. Uh, and as value accrues in the network as it's bonded, uh, we can start putting more liquidity through the network and that revenue supply can go up and therefore support even more darkness. We are days away from testnet and probably by the time this comes out, it'll already have happened. Over the next 12 months, we're very confident that we're gonna be able to achieve a mainnet launch. Uh, we'll be releasing the partners that we've been working with and um, we'll release more and more demonstrations of the technology over the coming months. 